Hey guys, how are you guys doing today? Today I am here to do a wig review on this wig on my head. And yes, it is a synthetic wig. Um, it's very similar to the black wig. Oh, sorry, it's looking a little dusty right now. Um, I haven't combed it in a minute. <laughs> um, it's similar to um, the black wig that I have been rocking and I um, did the flip over method with. Um, it's the exact same wig but in a different color. The specs is, it's a Bobby Bob Lana Slick MLF 217 Synthetic Lace Front Wig. Um, it was $39.99. Um, I got it in two colors, 1B and TT6, hold on, TT6 slash 2724. Um, I believe this one was more expensive from not mistaken I think the 1B was 36 and then the colored one was um, 39.99 if I'm not mistaken they have um, a yaki texture um, that's more you know <laughs> the yaki texture uh, and then this is the sleek one which is just like a regular synthetic wig I've worn this for like a week now um, the other wig I've been wearing for like a month um, on and off obviously because I don't wear it every single day. Um, I don't wear my synthetic wigs every single day. Um, but yeah, it came with, um, you know, the regular lace that I had to cut off. Um, I did not pluck anything on here. This is straight unplucking. Um, this kind of looks lumpy because of my braiding. Um, my hair is braided down right here. Um, so it kind of bumps this up, which is annoying, um, but, you know, you can do it differently if you are not stupid like me and braid your hair differently. Um, this hair sheds, um, especially after you cut the lace. I don't know if I just cut the lace wrong, uh, but it does shed even afterwards. Um, so you have to be careful about that when I brush my hair, like, a good... Not like a chunk, like maybe like five or six strands will come out. Um, and then it, the, in the back, it kind of gets stiff. I noticed in the black one, um, it got stiff after like two weeks. Um, so there's that. It isn't a full lace wig. Um, the lace is just kind of like right here and that um, the rest is like wefted. Um, it has two combs in the front, one in the back. I don't really appreciate the combs because they kind of tug and pull in my hair and I don't use the combs. Um, it's very snug for my bigger head. If your head is small, you might, ooh, sorry. If your head is small, you might want to use the combs or use bobby pins to secure the wig. But like I said, my, he my head is ginormous, um, so I don't have that problem. Um, the parting is really weird though because it goes all the way back here and then it stops dramatically so it kind of leaves a little like i feel like the parting goes way too far i feel like we just need it like right here that's all i need that's all i need but it goes all the way yeah and it makes this little you see y'all see that bump yeah i'm not a big fan Oh, flyaways. There's quite a few. I, you guys probably won't be able to see it if you do. Great. Good job, camera. But there is quite a bit of flyaways that I have to get some hairspray with um, a toothbrush and um, lay flat. Um, there's not really a big difference between the black, the 1B, and, the, uh, and this color, the TT62724. Is that it? Um, there's not really much of a difference in the style or anything like that. Um, it hits right by, right at my chin, which is what I appreciate. Um, that's what I prefer in my bobs. And it is um, a lace front. So that is another thing. Um, for the black one, I, you can use Got To Be Glue to glue the lace on your scalp. And then you can do, you, it doesn't have to be just the middle part. Um, so yeah, for the black one, I did the flip over uh, style that you guys really liked when I posted it on Snapchat. Um, so yeah, that is definitely an option for this wig, which is really like interesting for a synthetic wig that you wouldn't, you know, you, know, you wouldn't expect it. I like this color. 
um it is a bit cooler than i thought it would be um online it looked like a a pinky rose that had like a tint of rose in it and then when i got it i was like this looks nothing like the picture um but i still like it um i do prefer warmer blondes than this cool very cool blonde but it's nice to try um i don't really appreciate like it being like black and then straight into this dramatic blonde i would like to like lean into it a bit like with another color maybe um i think that would have been better for the ombre it's just like a strat color like a really big contract you know um but i like the blend of the color that it's not just like <laughs> you know what i mean it's not just like a line it's a nice little you know blend into it um with the you know ombre but i just wish there was a another color in between the two that would have made it real nice real noise um but yeah that's about it um let me know um if you guys have any questions about the wig i would highly recommend it um like i said it did shed a bit and it does tingle in the back uh and it's hot <laughs> it's really really hot i don't know if it's i don't know if it's this specific wig or i have i haven't worn a wig in a minute but it's hot under my scalp you guys <laughs> um but I, I don't think that has anything to do with the wig really if you guys would like to see how i did the lace front but i feel like there's so many like lace front tutorials on youtube um so i don't really think that's necessary for me to do one i i don't like to just keep repeating the things people that's why i don't i didn't want to film a how to make a wig tutorial because i feel like there's literally like 10 billion of them on youtube um but yeah that is it thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video and it was informative let me know if you have any questions down below i'll put the links for the wig um, down below as well and you can like google search just if it's sold out at that specific store you can google search and find it anywhere there's so many options for where to buy wigs um, and if you guys like more hair reviews I actually ordered um, human hair this time from Wow Africa or uh, some, something like that one of those sites for Black Friday um, so I'm gonna have that review up as soon as it comes in I'm really excited um, but yeah so if you guys like hair reviews like hit the like button and i will continue to do hair reviews thank you guys so much for watching bye